Hey guys, what's up? I'm doing another vlog. And I'm really sorry that I couldn't have been around for a few days. But as you know, school started, so I'm pretty busy with that. No, skateboard wheel. Don't spin. But anyways, I just got back from Target. And I also got my Minifig Cat order. So I hear lots of stuff is in there. It's really, really cool. I also do have some more updates to my Naruto figures. But I'm not sure if I want to show you in this update. But, yeah. Um, before I show you the stuff I got from Target, I do want to show you what I did get at Borders, because, you know, Borders is going out of business and everything. So, I love manga. As you see, I have the manga my manga collection. And I stopped reading for a while, and I, um, I usually watch the episodes, and I'm following Naruto Shippuden on AnimeSeason.com and Naruto.com and watching the episodes and stuff. And, you know, I got, I've got really, really cool stuff. So, um, I'll just go ahead and show you. Here. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not gonna review manga, but if any of you want me to review um, the illustration book, I mean, it's really cool. It has really cool artwork in it. It's amazing. And as you know, I am an artist. I do draw anime, so all and also other stuff as well. I can draw anything, but I mean, I usually draw mostly anime. But I did get this for like. Uh, this was a little more expensive. This was like five bucks. Not obviously a lot of money, but I mean compared to the other stuff. And it does have the original Naruto, which was in the weekly Shonen Jump in Japan. And it's a similar base storyline from the beginning, but then it completely changes towards the manga since it was just one thing. So, it's really cool. And as you see, he could still do his jutsus and stuff, all that. Uh, he's still is a fox, but he's not obviously the nine-tailed fox and stuff. And <laughs> funniest part that I saw is that he still had his sexy jutsu, and Masashi Kishimoto actually decided to keep that in there. So that's pretty cool. But I do have 37. I already read this. Um, 49. I've not read, and I also did get this one, which is in my bag. Oh yeah, and my skate shop sticker all the way. Oh my hoodie. Let me hang it up real fast. Dude. Come on. Come on. Hang up. There you go. Okay. So, I'm also going to get my sketchbook out. And, yeah. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. There you go. So, I also got this volume, number 47. I haven't started reading it yet, but I read part of it. It's really good. The only th trouble that I have is because this is in the middle of a battle, so I want to get 48. And also 38, because he, like, this really sucks how it ends. I mean, like, really. And then he, like, does a jutsu that he's been practicing, and he perfects it with, like, shadow clones, and then all of a sudden, he freaking, like, you know, it's a cutoff. But this is pretty old, so I could just, I already know what happened. It's just, it's kind of weird to just have that one. But I do want 47, 40, and 49, even though I am caught up, because, I mean, this is in the middle of the battle, and this is farther than the show, so it's an importance to have that. Just for the sake of having it and reading it through the manga, I'd, I'd rather not gap to 49. But, um, this is already 3 minutes 29, so this is going to be a longer vlog. Sorry about that, but, um, let me switch hands, because this does read from right to left. Oh, oh, wait, that's the actual cover. It's an amazing drawing. See that? It's so detailed. It's amazing. Um, and this is the awesome book cover that you do get with it, of course. And this was u this was usually twenty dollars, and I did pay maybe about five bucks or so for it, five six bucks, I guess, something around there. And I saved seventy two dollars when I bought the book. So, oh wow, I didn't even notice this. All of the manga and stickers, and that's really cool. As well as oh, this is cool. This is, this is awesome. I need to hang this up. This is really sick. All of the tails. Like obviously, you know Naruto's and nine tails. Um, oh, that sucks. It's double side. Why can't they just do a big one? So it's like five tails. Gar in the middle. Um, can't think of the other people's names right now. But and then there's Naruto's. That sucks. Gar and Naruto are like a couple of my favorite characters. I mean, I would rather have Naruto and Gara, you know, hanging it like together. But yeah, there you go. Great picture right there. Yeah, switch hands again because you know, really cool. So I will be drawing some of these. I do have some artwork to show you in this vlog. So 
it's really really good animation or drawing was later turned to animation a lot of these really sick I still don't understand why the Rasengan Shuriken is orange because it's blue but you know whatever there you go that's a really famous picture like right when they were showing the previous for Shippuden a few years back I was seeing that it's really cool it's a remake of the original version of Naruto except in Shippuden version there you go. I'm not going to show you all these but that one's really cool as well and these are just amazing art pieces Sage Mode, Naruto, all that um, do, do, do. ha 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 and there you go it's really cool and there were some really casual ones in here those are, those are awesome these are just really cool to look at I mean these are awesome you could hang this up and here's one of my favorite ones jeez I didn't even notice this one before I thought this was another one, but nah, man, I, I love this a lot more than the one that I was gonna, gonna that I thought this was. Jeez, this is awesome. I didn't even, I somehow skipped by that before. These are awesome right here. I love this one. I just love all these pictures, because, I mean, those are manga covers. Those are really cool. This is a famous picture as well. But, I mean, you can see this at Borders even if you're not going to buy it, if you want to see more of that badly. That one's amazing. I love that one. That's like one of my favorites in the book. But you can see this is a really cool book. And, you know, there's the Ikoski. And this... Oh, God. Come on. I just want to show you this one thing. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. I mean, with all these guys, these are all members of the Ikoski now. And this is Sasuke. I mean, you could show it. It shows that, you know, pretty much anybody could turn bad. And it's really sad because, you know, all these guys later die in the series... And, you know, you could see, as kids, they were all just regular people, and they just turned like that. And Naruto and Sakura are still good. Sasuke's kind of slowly turning away. It, it sucks, you know, but really cool. Awesome book. There was the original price. I think I paid, like, five bucks for it. Sorry about going into such detail with that, but sorry, you know. I do also want to show you some artwork I've been working on, because a lot of you guys do know that I draw. This one came out like crap. I just want to say it really came out bad. It looked really terrible. I should just rip it out and throw it away. I'm not going to, though. There's Naruto. I do that. As well as your Itachi. Um, fail. Um, Kiba. Came out really good. Rock Lee. And I wasn't looking at any of these when I drew them. Like, these were all just for memory. So that's the coolest part about it. It was like, I, I was just drawing these in school. And Sasuke is everyone's favorite when I showed them because they just like nailed it with the way he looks and his hair and everything. People love it and the shading just looks good. And everybody just loves it when I show it to them. So, that was for art, uh, for art as well, I had to draw a portrait, even though it looks something like me. Friend drew that, um, terrible, I don't know why it's there. Not Rotel. I just finished this one, it took me like a day and a half to do. Really good. This is like one of my favorite drawings I've ever drawn, just because of the way that I captured the detail. So, I drew that, I didn't trace it, I drew it. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry about going into such detail of the book and all that, Naruto, all that, but, derp, and I also did draw this as well, which I hope to scan on my computer on some thick paper, on some cardstock, and hang it up, because I worked hard on this for a few days, it's really cool, so, yeah, little Sasuke thing, but yeah, um, and I'm, I was going to do the minifig cat unboxing, but I guess I'll have to do that in my next vlog. Not next vlog, I'll just do a separate unboxing video on my phone. But now I just want to show you what I got at Target. First thing, is this really cool Luke Skywalker dog tag. I'm getting the white. Come on, I want to reach 10 minutes. There you go. And there's a bunch, so I'm really lucky that I got Luke, because I didn't want to buy maybe more than one or two. But I don't want to reach over 10 minutes, come on. I just want to show you these guys, and I'll do a review of these, I promise. I haven't done action figure reviews lately, so, you know. Target did get the full wave. They didn't have Wolf, but they did have his wave. So I really want to get that. Arf Trooper from Camino looks amazing. Um, his speeder board really cool. Plo looks amazing. I just really I'm not a huge Plo Koon fan. Plo Koon fan, so I didn't really get it. I didn't get it because you know. But there you go. Jet is amazing. I've awaited him, and I, I for, kind of forgot about this guy actually. So you know, I'm kind of happy that I got it. Really happy actually, because you know they had a bunch, and I chose to get that over all them. They did have Savage, but I'm waiting to get another Chewy. But yeah, so sorry about this. I have to cut off so suddenly. 
I will do an unboxing for Mini Fit Cat next. See you guys later. Bye.